This morning, I started by talking about divine promotion. Ce matin, j'ai commencé par parler de la di promotion divine. And by definition, et par définition, we said that divine promotion. Nous disons que la promotion divine was a progressive alignment of the plan of God for your life. C'est un alignement progressif du plan de Dieu dans votre vie. Because whenever you say that a man is promoted, parce qu'on dit que l'homme est promu. I'm not the one that sets the standard for promotion. Je ne suis pas celui qui établit le standard pour la promotion. And so it is when the one that rules sees that the person has fulfilled the requirement, then he promotes. C'est celui qui dirige voit que la personne a accompli les exigences de la promotion. It doesn't matter. Ça ne dépend pas. How much? Combien? A child in grade three. Un enfant en troisième année. It doesn't matter how much you identify as being in grade six. Ça ne dépend pas de comment est-ce que vous l'identifiez étant en sixième. Until you pass the requirements for grade six, you are still in grade three. Jusqu'à ce que vous passez les exigences de grade trois, vous êtes encore Because à grade six. Because the standard for promotion is set by God. Parce que le standard de promotion est établi par Dieu. That is why the Bible says. Et la Bible dit. La promotion cometh not from the east, the west, or the south. La promotion ne vient pas de l'est, de l'ouest, du sud ou du nord. But that God is the judge. Mais c'est Dieu lui-même qui donne. Qui Isaiah compte. chapter 40. Isaiah 40. Isaiah chapter 40. Isaiah 40. Don't forget also this morning. N'oublie pas ce matin. We stated some few things. Nous allons faire certaines choses. Why God will promote? Pourquoi Dieu promet? And we said that God promotes first of all. Nous avons dit que Dieu promet d'abord. In alignment with His purpose. En alignement avec son propos. And that is why you will notice. C'est pourquoi vous allez remarquer. Whenever God raises a man. Quand Dieu élève un homme. It is for a purpose. C'est pour un propos. Whenever God equips a man. Quand Dieu équipe un homme, it is for a purpose. C'est pour un objectif. And so we need to understand. Nous devons ainsi comprendre that the purpose of God, que l'objectif de Dieu, is the reason why God will promote. C'est la raison pour laquelle Dieu promettra. Isaiah chapter 40. Isaiah 40. Verse 31. Verse 31. The Bible says that the day that wait upon the Lord will renew or find new strength. They will mount up with wings like eagles. They will run and not get tired. They will walk and not faint. Let's read it together. But those who wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They will mount up with wings like eagles. They will run and not get tired. They will walk and not faint. May the Lord bless the reading of his word. Que le Seigneur bénisse la lecture de sa parole. In this second service, Dans ces deuxième service, because I have said that in, in the morning I said, parce que le matin j'ai dit, that it is impossible to walk with God and not have a benefit accrued to you. C'est impossible de marcher avec Dieu et ne pas avoir le bénéfice qu'il a mis en toi. Because God is not a user of men. Parce que Dieu n'est pas l'utilisateur des hommes. Just like it is impossible. Comme aussi c'est impossible. To work for certain companies without certain benefit accruing to you. De travailler pour certaines compagnies sans que certains bénéfices vous soient accrus. The principles of God. Les principes de Dieu. And the things that men follow. Ce sont des choses que les hommes font. And so oui. men, for example, les hommes, par exemple, if you work in certain companies, quand vous travaillez dans certaines compagnies, they will tell you ils vous diront that as part of your retirement package, comme euh, paquet de, de, de retraite, instead of giving you extra money, they give you shares. Au, au lieu de vous donner un peu d'argent, ils vous donnent and, des parts. And, and the longer you work in that company, the more the shares. Et les plus vous travaillez dans cette compagnie, les plus so de parts vous donnez. So that when you retire, Quand vous allez prendre la retraite, Just like Jesus said, comme Jésus Christ l'a dit, that in this world where you are working, dans ce monde quand vous and travaillez, in the world to come, et dans celui à venir, because when you retire in the service of God, parce que quand vous prenez la retraite dans le service de Dieu, the package is out of this world. When a man, quand un homme, retire 
part in the service of God by debt. Il prend la retraite dans les services de Dieu the avec des retirement package. Votre paquet de retraite is out of this world. Et au-delà de ce monde. And as I Jesus Christ said. Voilà pourquoi Jésus-Christ dit in my father's house. Et dans la maison de mon père. There are many mansions. Il y a beaucoup de mansions. You know there are a lot of statements I like. There are statements of the person is bold to say. Il y a de propos dont vous êtes fier de le dire. That how many of you are there? Combien sont là? In my father's house. Dans la maison de mon père. There is enough for all of you. S'il y a assez pour tout ce monde. He said if it were not so. Si vous n'avez pas semé. I won't tell you that. Je vais pas vous dire ça. Because I'm the one that came from heaven. I know what is there. Parce que je suis celui qui vient du ciel. Je sais ce qu'il y a. And so when we are talking about promotion. Quand nous parlons de la promotion. There is a part that accrues to God. Il y a une portion qui est liée à Dieu. What accrues to you? Ce qui vient is a byproduct of what accrues in heaven. C'est un produit dérivé de ce qu'il y a dans le ciel. Let me say it again. Je vais le dire encore. What accrues to you? Ce qui vous arrive is a byproduct. C'est un produit dérivé of what has accrued in heaven. De ce qui a accru dans le ciel. And therefore, I will enjoy it and every one of you. Et je vous dirai à tous. To please restructure your thinking. S'il vous plaît, restructurez votre pensée. That on my watch, God must make profit. Sur ma vue, Dieu what did I say? On my watch, Sur God vue, must make. Dieu doit faire un intérêt. No, there are some sayings that we grow up saying. Il y a certains dire dont nous grandissons. That either the dire, master sells or not. Que le maître le dise ou pas. That the servant, the hiring will be paid, right? Le serviteur sera payé. Have you ever had a bankruptcy? J'ai déjà eu. <laughs> Ah, God forbid. And even the places where people say it. Même dans les endroits où les gens disent ça. Even without bankruptcy. Même sans déficit bancaire. Your month is 90, 90 days long. Votre mois est 90 jours. Uh, some of you won't understand that. Certains ne comprendront pas. 90 days long because when you work from January 1st to January 31st. Quand vous travaillez de janvier 1 au janvier 31. Your salary is only paid March 31st. How many months? How many days is a month then? Is 90 days. Ça fait 30 jours. So in the kingdom of God, dans le royaume des cieux, until each of us makes up our mind, and say, as far as I am here, aussi long et dire aussi longtemps. As far as I'm a child of God, aussi longtemps que je suis un enfant de Dieu, promotion will come. I know. La promotion viendra de soi. But what I'm after Mais ce dont je suis après is to bring glory to God. C'est d'amener la gloire à Dieu. Because when you bring glory to God, Parce que quand vous amenez la gloire à Dieu, then you can pray. Et maintenant vous pouvez prier. Brethren, I pray God opens your eyes. Je prie pour que Dieu There was a prayer Dieu. Jesus was praying. Quand Jésus Christ priait, He said, Father, il disait, Père, I have glorified you on the earth. Je te glorifie sur la terre. You remember that prayer, John chapter 16 or 17? Vous savez, Jean he said, therefore, now. <laughs> is it, I think it's Job chapter 13 or so. Where Job, Job said, he said, I will reason with the Almighty. La raison pour so le, Jesus is saying, son. look. Jesus Christ dit, écoute. Because you don't lie. Parce que tu mens pas. I have glorified you on the earth. Je t'ai glorifié sur la terre. He said, therefore. Par conséquent. Glorify your son. Glorifie ton fils. Will God have a choice but to answer that prayer? Dieu n'avait pas de choix que de répondre à cette prière. No wonder when the sun was about to go. Quand le soleil devait partir. God. Dieu. The unthinkable. Il a fait l'impensable. One man was about to die. Un homme devait mourir. Carrying the sin of the world. Il avait les péchés du monde. For three hours, nobody could move. Pendant trois heures, personne n'a bougé. Because there was darkness on the surface of the earth. Parce qu'il y avait le ténèbre sur Without la terre. Without talking. Without talking. The centurion said. Le centurion a dit. Surely. Hey, certainement. This. Celui-ci. Was the son of God. Hmm. C'était l'enfant de Dieu. But then I've often said. J'ai toujours dit, frères et sœurs. There are different kinds of death. Il y a beaucoup de différentes sortes de morts. When I was young, they used to pray. Quand j'étais jeune, j'ai prié. 
Ah, my God, as we are going to bed, let us not die in our sleep. Didn't your mother pray that prayer? Or your mother didn't pray that prayer? But you see, as a boy, I used to wonder. Is it better to die in accident? I've come to a stage death doesn't matter. Je suis à une étape où ça ne fait rien. Because daily I am doing the will of my father. Parce que journalièrement, quotidiennement, je fais la volonté de mon père. When you are doing the will of God, you are not scared to die. Quand tu fais la volonté de Dieu, tu n'as pas peur de What mourir. What did Paul say? He said, for me to live Pourquoi is Christ. Dit, What is the gain? Is to die. Qu'est-ce que je, qu'est-ce qu'il gagne? Have you seen any Christian that doesn't want to go to heaven? Est-ce qu'il y a-t-il un chrétien qui ne veut pas aller au ciel? But you don't want to die. Don't worry, I'm not talking of death today, but I'm just letting you know that when a man has done the will of God, then you'll be able to say, I have fought a good fight. You know, if you fought a good fight, you know. And if you have not, you will also know. Et si tu ne le fais pas, tu connais but aussi. the Lord will help you that you'll be, suc- that you'll be victorious in the name of Jesus. So now we want to talk about what exactly then are the benefits of divine promotion. Because the divine promotion Parce que dans la promotion divine, and the Bible says that they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength la Bible dit que ceux qui it means that something is accruing to me. Are we, are we together? It means that as I wait, something is accruing to me. And as something is accruing to me, it means that I'm not the same. And the, when the Bible says that they shall renew their strength, it means that I've gone from one level of strength to Another. The Bible says that it is God that gives you strength. And so if that same God decides to renew that strength, then it means that I have gone to another level. What then are the benefits? Number one. Whenever God divinely promotes a man, Quand Dieu promet divinement un homme, your circle of influence must increase. <laughs> Votre niveau d'influence grandit. What the first thing I said, your circle of what? Que j'ai dit? Influence must influence grandit. <laughs> I can give, let me use one example that all of us recognize. Je vais vous donner un exemple que nous allons tous reconnaître. Some years ago, il y a quelque temps, if you mention the name of Daddy Gio, si vous mentionnez le nom du General Ovasia, some people will say, "Who is that?" Certaines personnes diront, "Qui est-il?" But by the grace of God, et par la grâce de Dieu, wherever we say that this man is coming and we show his profile, quand nous disons que cet homme est en train de venir et nous montrons, without le without meeting him, sans le rencontrer, they want to be at their best to receive him. Ils veulent être faire leur mieux pour le recevoir. The circle of influence has increased. Le cercle d'influence a fait quoi? Augmenté. God cannot promote you and your circle of influence will remain the same. Dieu ne peut pas vous promouvoir et votre cercle d'influence reste le même. How do you know that your circle of influence has increased? Comment pouvez-vous connaître que votre cercle d'influence a augmenté? People that need your help will increase. Les gens qui ont besoin de votre aide vont augmenter. <laughs> Nobody is asking for your help. Personne ne demande pour l'aider. It means that you are not better than them. C'est-à-dire que vous n'êtes pas mieux que. Are we together? Sommes-nous ensemble? Do you ask help from people that are not better than you? Demandez-vous de l'aide aux gens qui ne sont pas mieux que vous? You don't. Non, vous ne demandez it pas. It is the people that you perceive are better in particular areas that you go to for help. Ce sont des gens dont vous pensez qu'ils sont mieux dans un certain domaine que vous. And so l'aide. when your when God promotes a man. Quand Dieu promet un homme, the circle of influence of that man will naturally increase. Le cercle d'influence de cet homme augmente When God promoted Daniel, 
Quand Dieu a promis Daniel, a circle of influence, le cercle d'influence, when God promoted Esther, quand Dieu a promis a circle Esther, of influence did what? Son cercle d'influence Esther a quoi? began to influence kings. Esther a commencé à influencer les rois. When God promoted Joseph, Quand Dieu a promu Joseph, the Bible says that the king himself said, la Bible dit que le roi a dit, whatever you say in Egypt goes, ce que vous dites en Egypt but then what is that? Fait. Influence. Savez, c'est quoi ça? C'est une influence. When God Quand Dieu promoted Samson, a promu Samson, not only did the circle of influence increase, Non seulement le cercle d'influence augmente. But remember what I said in the beginning, in the first service, that if the foundation be faulty, what service, can the, the righteous? Samson is one guy that I pity a lot. Samson is one guy that I pity a lot. Samson est l'une des personnes que j'ai pitié beaucoup. And the reason I pity him is because. La raison pour laquelle j'ai pitié de Samson, c'est parce que. The problem from his father's house didn't allow him to succeed. Le problème dans la maison de son père. Go back and read it. Vali. Judges chapter 13 to 15. Juge 13 à 15. The Bible says that there was a man called Manoah of the tribe of Dan. Il y avait un homme appelé Manoah de la tribe de Dan. Go to Genesis 49 and read what Jacob said to Dan. Va à Jacob 31 et lit et lire ce que Jacob said, Dan, dit à Dan. Il dit Dan. The wayward shall your generations be. On verra ta génération. Was Samson wayward? N'était pas Samson? <laughs> Every time Samson opened his mouth in scripture, he saw a woman. Toutes les fois que Samson a ouvert sa bouche dans les écritures, il voit une femme. Eventually. Eventuellement. The circle of influence that God gave him. Le cercle d'influence que Dieu lui a donné. He lost it. May you not lose your circle of influence. Perdu, Number two. Deux. Number two. Deux. Whenever God divinely promotes a man, Quand Dieu <laughs> veut un homme, promotion comes with responsibility. La promotion vient avec responsibility. It is a benefit of divine promotion. And C'est why is it a benefit? De la promotion divine. Some of you don't even know that you are bored now because you don't have responsibility. <laughs> but when God promotes you, responsibilities increase. The reason why a lot of people pray certain prayers is because they don't know the responsibility that goes with it. They don't know. Oh, I know what it is like to pastor a church of five people. And I also know what it is like to pastor a church of our size. As you pray for growth in the kingdom, your responsibility does what? Increase. I don't need to go far. There was a time that our choir were two or three people. The piano prayer. Piano. The drummer, les jeux, les joueurs, les piano, and les somebody joueurs, that God placed there to make a joyful noise. Et dont Dieu a béni pour faire une voix. And as hard as it might be for you people to believe, sometimes I was the one making the joyful noise. These days when I sing, ce que j'ai dit, most of you just point to the next one. Let pastor give it to the choir that they don't, don't kill us with a voice here. But what has happened now? The responsibility has been transferred. And the responsibility of the choir leader last year is not the same as this year. Are we together? Divine promotion seamlessly brings responsibility that you did not ask for. That's why I'm always worried. C'est pourquoi je m'inquiète souvent. When people aspire to certain things that their character may not be able to carry. Quand des gens aspirent à certaines choses dont leur caractère ne se conforme pas. The first thing I said was what? Influence. The second is what? Responsibility. Between those two alone, 
entre ces deux seulement, you can shape the lives of generations behind you. Vous pouvez scruter la vie Just de ces générations. When you have the ability to influence. Quand vous avez l'habilité d'influencer. You know, let, let, let me just say it with all humility. Je vais le dire avec toute humilité. If only leaders will understand the responsibility that God puts on them, they won't be fighting on TV and talking about themselves. There is too much to do Il y a à faire. than for me to remember that somebody said my trouser was not good. There is too much example to lay Il y a beaucoup d'exemples à partir. That for me to remember that when I was 14, that one somebody did not smile to me. Pour que je me rappelle quand j'avais 14 ans, quelqu'un qui ne m'avait pas souri. What did Apostle Paul say? He said, forgetting the things that are where? Qu'est-ce que l'Apostle Paul dit? Il dit, oubliez. Why do you forget the things that are behind? Hebrews chapter 12, Hebrews looking unto Jesus. De l'avant. Please listen. Écoute, s'il vous plaît. Jesus said, Jésus-Christ dit, if you cause one of these to stumble, si vous causez, how many is one? One. Une, <laughs> he said it will be better. Ça sera mieux. You know why? Ça because as you are promoted, Parce que quand tu es promu, you have more influence, tu as beaucoup d'influence, you have more responsibility. Tu as beaucoup de responsibility. When you are just a member in the church, Quand tu es juste un membre dans la chorale, and it's only once in four weeks that the camera picks you. C'est seulement une fois dans les quatre semaines que la caméra. It's not a, it's not a problem. C'est pas un problème. Even people at your work, they may not watch, they may not watch that part that the camera picked you. Même les gens dans ton travail ne peuvent pas voir cette part, cette portion que la caméra a piquée. Now you are the one leading the choir. Et maintenant c'est toi qui dirige la chorale. So the members of your work are watching you sing. As your circle of influence increased or not? As your responsibility increased or not? To whom much is given, much is. The way they weigh what you say when you are a member is not the way they weigh what you say when you are the leader. De la manière que tu dis des choses quand tu es juste un travailleur. All I'm asking you to do. The Bible says, be quick to hear, La Bible dit, but slow to speak. En et lent en there are some things you will never hear me say. Y a des vous pas dire. It's not because I don't have an opinion. Ce n'est pas parce que je n'ai pas but it is because my opinion does not count in the grand scheme of things. Parce que mon ne pas dans cette... In those days, we say that when God is talking, who am I to say I have an idea? Dans ces temps, on disait, quand Dieu parle, qui suis-je pour dire que j'ai une idée? Wow. What are the benefits of divine what? Promotion. Number three. When God promotes a man, God is giving you an opportunity to grow. Dieu vous donne l'opportunité de grandir. He's giving you an opportunity to do what? To grow. Il vous donne l'opportunité de faire quoi? De grandir. Growth in the kingdom is not automatic. La, grande, la croissance dans le royaume n'est pas automatique. Let me say it again. Growth in the kingdom is not automatic. Laisse-moi le dire encore. La croissance dans le royaume n'est when pas. When God give, when God promote a man to a certain level, all God is saying. Quand Dieu a promu un homme à un certain niveau, is that this dit, is an opportunity to grow. S'il vous a soumis à une opportunité That's what de God grandir. is saying. It is now left to you. Ça de toi to maintenant. take that responsibility serious de and prendre, grow into it. De cette responsabilité de manière sérieuse et grandir dans ça. Uh, I'll give you the example of Saul of Tarsus. Avez-vous eu l'exemple du When God called Saul of Tarsus. Saul de Tarsus. What God was doing was that God gave him an opportunity to. Ce que Dieu était en train de faire, c'est lui donner l'opportunité. You de know grandir. what he did? The Bible says for I think it was the, uh, Acts chapter eight or nine. The Bible says that he first of all spent three years. Ils ont dépassé trois. How many years? Three. Trois ans. I remember some years ago. Je me rappelle il y a quelques années. Ah, God have mercy. Somebody came to our church. Quelqu'un est venu dans notre église. And the word of God went out, and the person came out for altar call. Et la parole de Dieu est partie, et la personne est venue devant pour. Two Sundays later. 
Deux dimanches plus tard. The person came to call me. La par, la He came to meet me, church. He said, Pastor, I will not be coming to church again. Il a dit, je ne viendrai plus à l'église. He said, God has called me to be an evangelist. Dieu m'a appelé pour être un évangéliste. I didn't say anything. Je n'ai rien dit. So I said, what has changed in your life? J'ai dit, qu'est-ce qui a changé dans ta vie? He said, what do you mean? Il dit, qu'est-ce que vous voulez dire? I said, you used to smoke. You still smoke. Tu, tu étais en train de fumer. Tu fumes encore. You used to drink. You still drink. Vous étiez en train de boire. Vous buvez encore. I said, so what is the testimony that you are going to share? Quel est le témoignage que vous allez partager? He said, don't worry. God has called me to be an evangelist. Il dit, ne t'en fais pas. Dieu m'a appelé pour être un évangéliste. <laughs> Brethren, <laughs> when God calls a man, Quand Dieu un homme, God has looked at you. You know, I think it was in the book of Daniel where the Bible says that that king saw the, the handwriting on the wall. Remember? Right? Now, when God weighs you in the balance, Quand Dieu a évalué la balance the reason he's calling you is not because you weigh well. Oh. La raison qui vous appelle, c'est pas parce que vous avez The reason rien. he's calling you is because he wants to give you an opportunity to weigh properly. C'est parce que il veut vous donner l'opportunité de bien. That is why we say God does not call the qualified. Dieu n'a pas appelé. If I was qualified and God called me, then what has he done? Si j'étais qualifié que Dieu m'appelle. But when I'm not qualified. Et quand je suis pas qualifié. And God calls me. Et Dieu m'appelle. And every day I realize that it is a real opportunity. What am I doing? Then I'm striving to to be qualified. Tous les jours, je me rends compte que c'est une opportunité, donc je me force. Pour Some people still cannot believe it that I'm a pastor because we went to school together. Certains ne peuvent pas croire que je suis un pasteur parce que nous sommes allés à l'école ensemble. I said it is good. Mais ils savent. But God can call anybody. Number what? Dieu peut appeler n'importe qui. Number four. Cinq. Right, number four now. Okay, number four. Quatre. Benefits of divine what? Promotion. Benefits de la promotion divine. Number four. Quatre. You will like this one. Vous allez aimer celui-ci. One of the things that happens when God divinely promotes a man. Quand Dieu, c'est une des choses qui se fait quand is that Dieu décide de abundant provisions come with it. Beaucoup de promotions viennent. What did I say comes with it? Abundant provision. La bo- provision bon, abondant, it bien was bien. in it was in Luke chapter 22. Luke 23. Jesus said, "When I sent you without a money bag, quand, Jésus dit, quand j'étais envoyé, he asked them a question. Il les a posé une question. He said, Did you lack anything? As-tu aimé toute chose? They said no. Il dit non. Up until that time, it was never heard of that you will go without a money bag and you will not be hungry. Jusqu'à ce temps-là, ce n'était pas compris que vous allez But pas... Jesus took them. Jésus-Christ les a pris. He called them from where they were. Il les a appelés de là qu'ils sont. Promoted them the first time. Il les a promis la première fois. Then promoted them and sent them out. Il les a promis et les a envoyés. Giving them an opportunity. Remember what I said. Leur and what? Opportunity. opportunity to grow. L'opportunité de grandir. So then when they came back. Quand ils sont venus. He said, now let me see if you have grown. Let me see now if you can testify with the faithfulness of God. You said that time when I sent you out, you didn't tell me, but I know your heart. You are a little bit skeptical. He said, but did you lack anything? But then do you think it is the work of your hand that is sustaining you? Vous pensez-vous que c'est le travail de vos mains qui vous soutient? How many people are working harder than you? They are worse off than you. Que, quand, combien de gens travaillent plus que vous, mais ils sont It is called abundant provision. C'est la provision abondante. Occasionally, I tell people, I have provision that you can see. Occasionnellement, j'ai dit aux gens, j'ai la provision que vous pouvez pas voir. Because my help comes. Parce que mon aide vient de Dieu. If it is dollar that you are depending on, si dollar will depreciate. Les dollars vont déprécier. The value of your dollar last year is not the value of your dollar this year. Votre valeur de dollar l'année passée c'est pas la même valeur cette année. But the, but the things of God does not depreciate. Mais les choses de Dieu ne déprécient jamais. And so when God promotes a man, quand Dieu promet promeut un homme. The Bible says in 1 Corinthians chapter 14. La Bible dit en 1 Corinthiens 14. That he gave unto them different gifts. Il les a donné différents dons. 
What are those gifts supposed to do? Qu'est-ce que ces dons doivent faire? Because that is why he was talking about all the gifts of the word of knowledge, the word of wisdom, right? Voilà what are those gifts supposed to do? La de la the Bible says a man's gift. La Bible they do what? Le don le don de Have you noticed that Jesus never raised money when he was on earth? Have you noticed? Have you noticed that is the, there's no way recorded where Jesus said, people, I'm hungry, oh, please contribute money for me. No. Vous n'avez pas vu qu'il y a pas, vous n'avez If anything, the only thing he said, he said, look, the son of man has nowhere to lay down his head. Au lieu que mon fils aille dormir, uh, I believe personally, it was a statement of humility. Je crois personnellement que c'était un propos d'humilité. If Jacob could find a place to lay his head, si Jacob, Jacob uh, how will Christ not find a place to lay his head? But he wanted to know which one of them wanted to follow him for food. And so he said, for your information, if you are following me because you want to be rich, don't come. Uh, but one man still snorking. You know the, you know the name. <laughs> Number one. <laughs> Number what? Number five. Jesus said, take heed and beware of what? For covetousness. For one man's, for a man's life does not what? Consist in the abundance of the things that he possesses. Abundant provision will be provided for you when God promotes you. Let me tell you a little few things about that abundant provision. God is my witness. Dieu est mon témoin. God is my witness. Dieu est mon témoin. Anytime I have a headache, Toutes les fois que j'ai mal à la tête, I query God. J'ai à Dieu. I dedicate my time. J'ai mon temps. I dedicate my this, I dedicate my that. For j'ai me to now ceci. dedicate time ça. to no sickness. It is unbecoming of my calling. My wife is here, my children are here, you can ask them. No. If I have a headache, it's because I've not slept. The care for my headache is sleep. It's called divine health. Are we together? And so when we're talking about provision, I'm not just talking of money. The Bible says that your children shall be taught of the Lord and great shall be their peace. You think it is easy to raise three children in Canada? Especially when you are the only one that is different in the community. You people won't understand now. Everywhere you look now, you find somebody that looks like you. Hey. Thank God my children are here. Ask them, when they went to that same school you are sending your children, they were the only one that looked like that. And then they say, Daddy, we want to go for sleepover. Are they not asking you for sleepover now? Immediately they say they want to go for sleepover. <laughs> I will remember that I watched a movie. That the father was a pedophile. Ah, I say, God, give me the way to escape. I'm just trying to explain to you that when those children now have grown and they are in the church of God, it is abundant provision. This is Canada. Your child can decide at the age of 16 that I'm an adult now. Don't talk to me. I can do anything I want to do. <laughs> but when God gives you children that listen to the voice of reason, it's called what? Abundant so when we are talking about abundant provision, all of you always think of money. There is, money can never repair a deformed child. Especially if the child is deformed 
Le Alors, caractère. Formé dans le caractère, là, je ne le réparera jamais. Il va prier. Rather than have money, you better pray for a child that is upstanding. Au lieu d'avoir l'argent, il faut consacrer sa vie à prier à un enfant. So when we are talking about abundant provision, quand nous parlons de la provision abondante, when God elevates you, quand Dieu vous élève, God makes sure that anywhere your children go, that they find help. Dieu se rassure que partout où vos enfants vont, ils auront de l'aide. It is what abundant provision. C'est la provision abondante. I can stand here and give you testimonies upon testimonies of how God will place people in positions that you can never imagine just because your child is going to pass by there. Je peux vous donner des témoignages et témoignages comment Dieu a déplacé les gens d'une Those are dans. benefits of what? Divine provision. Ce sont les bénéfices d'une provision divine. In those days, I used to ask myself, I, I, I couldn't ask my father. Je vais poser moi-même des questions. Je commence à. Uh, why is it that all these your friends, you people grew up together, but look at all of them, they, their children were born abroad. Comment est-ce que vous avez grandi ensemble? But me, I was born here. Tous les enfants ont grandi ailleurs. Why did you also go and give to back to me abroad? Pourquoi aussi tu ne m'as pas amené à, à, à l'étranger? <laughs> but these days your children will ask you. Mais c'est ces jours-ci vos enfants vous demanderont. In different ways. De manière différente. Daddy. Papa. Our neighbor has a 75-inch TV. Notre, notre oh, they don't ask you? Une, 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 uh, you think I don't know? De When they ask you that question, then you use that. You lie in the process. Tu mens dans le processus. But the Bible says, godliness with contentment. La great faith. Faith them avec confiance. Since I got to Canada, Depuis que je suis au Canada, I can tell you how many marriages are broken down. Je peux vous dire combien les mariages. In fact, let me just tell you the truth so that you can sit up. Je vais vous dire la vérité pour que vous vous y asseyez. Africans and blacks marriages are breaking up faster than Caucasians now. Les mariages africains I'm telling you, I'm telling you statistics now. Some of you that have friends in Calgary, talk to them. Ceux qui ont des frères, des amis à Calgary, parlez à eux. You have friends in Ontario, talk to them. Vous avez des amis en Ontario. That's why the Bible says, that which you have, do what? Hold fast. Your wife is not perfect. Thank God for her. Were you perfect when she married you? Or your husband suddenly now is not perfect because somebody is complimenting you every day at work. Vous, votre mari n'est pas soudainement parfait parce qu'il y a quelqu'un qui... So vous... that your husband that used to be romantic is no longer romantic. Par moment, votre mari qui était romantique n'est plus romantique. <laughs> Romance, faith. La foi, romance. I'm telling you the truth. Je vous dis la vérité. It's called divine promotion that Exactement. comes with provision. When you look at your house, your wife is there, your husband is there, your children are there, you are the envy of the world. Number four or five that I wanted to go to. Five. What else? Oh, whatever number, just number it yourself. <laughs> what else are the benefits of divine provision or promotion? There is joy and fulfillment. Il y a la joie. The Bible says, who for the joy that was set before him. La joie who for the joy that was set before him. <laughs> la joie qui est who for the joy that was set before him. Pour la joie qui était he endured the cross. Il a he despised la the shame. Il a la honte. Let me ask you, Je vais vous demander. Is shame is written on somebody's forehead? Est-ce que la honte est écrite sur la tête de quelqu'un? Doesn't matter. C'est, ça ne dépend pas. As far as it's for Christ, you better go through it. Aussi longtemps que c'est pour Christ, vous devez for y aller. For promotion to come. Pour les promotions à venir. I've shared the experience with you. I'll say it again for those of you that are not here. Je vais partager l'expérience et je vais les partager. Ici. A man called me long ago. He said, my friend, there are, there's a problem in my house. I quickly stood up. I went to the house. And I got to the house. The wife stood at the door. 
se tient debout. He said, can I help you? Il dit, peux-je vous aider? I said, I came to help you. Il dit, non, je suis venu vous aider. She said, as you enter. Quand tu, quand tu entres? After I entered and I spoke a few words. Je suis entré, j'ai dit quelques she mots. She got up and said, walk out of my house. Elle s'est aimée, dit, quitte ma maison. Is it written on my face that somebody has chased me from their house before? If I don't tell you, will you know? But because of that, I became wiser. Are we together? Joy and what? Fulfillment. By themselves, they sent me a message later. That sorry about the last time. But what you came for, God has answered your prayer. Till today, the family is together. Is shame a price too much to pay for that? No. Uh, I don't want them to embarrass me. You better embarrass yourself first before they embarrass you. I don't think some of you know what happened on the cross. The Bible says that they took his tunic after tunic. What is it, many? Let your imagination run wild. After tunic, what is remaining? It's underwear. You think there was trouser? Remember the woman with issue of blood? The Bible says, the, the Bible didn't say that she grabbed him at the hem of his trouser. What did the Bible say? At the hem of his what? When that garment is gone, what is remaining? For how many hours he hung there? Everybody was looking at him. He was basically naked. And then you say that you don't want to go through shame. Which heaven do you want to go? There is a joy in suffering for Christ. There is a joy and fulfillment in knowing that God has used me for that family and that family and that family and that family. It doesn't matter what I lost. There is a joy. There is a joy. Knowing fully well that the history of 10 people in Cornerstone cannot be complete without you. Do you understand what I'm saying? There is a joy. When some people wake up in the morning and the husband and wife will come together, they say, if not for so so person, there is a joy in heaven. There is a joy that when people see their child, they remember the day you brought the child back home because the child was lost. There is a joy. There is a joy. That their child's first book was given by you. You think, you think they will forget? Oh, but now we are in Canada. It is everybody for himself. It still takes a village to raise a child. And you have that village now. Don't misuse the opportunities that God has given. When God divinely promotes you, Quand Dieu vous promet divinement, seamlessly, seamlessly, simplement, your life won't be the same. Votre vie ne sera pas la même. You know what I mean by seamlessly? Ça veut dire quoi? Without struggle, your life will just not be the same. But what you are looking for is contained in the other things that God provides. Matthew chapter 6, verse 33. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and what? And then how many things? And all of these things. You know, I've realized that the more you look for respect, the more people disrespect you. 
Et mieux vous cherchez le respect, et mieux you've not, you've not thought about it. Ne vous respect pas. The more you look for respect, the more people do what? The mieux vous respect. cherchez le respect, the plus les gens ne vous respectent pas. How does respect come by service? Le service vient avec le le respect vient ah, avec le service. I, I won't mention. I will never forget the day I went to one of the elected officials' offices. Je veux pas oublier le jour où je suis allé. When they told him I wanted to come and see him. Ah, he said, he doesn't have a lot of time. That can it be quick? I said no problem. Even if you have three minutes, it's okay. So I entered. I introduced myself. I said I'm from Cornerstone. I said I came to see you in case there's anything that we can do to help you. The three minutes became a 45 minute conversation. Thank God, I did. you know, some of you, you only know how to go and look for help. You don't know how to look for help. You don't know how to help anybody. In fact, if your neighbor sees you driving into their driveway, they close their curtain quickly. Yesterday, when you were there, you were looking for help. Last week, when you were there, you were looking for help. Uh -uh. Are you the only needy person in the environment? Become a servant. Go to your neighbor. Try it. Go to your neighbor. Say, I just came to introduce myself. And I wanted to ask if there was anything I could do to help you. I said, and if there is nothing that you want me to do physically, can I pray with you? Have you ever seen anybody that refuses prayer? God helping you. That problem they used to have suddenly is gone. What has happened to you? Your circle of influence has. The things of God are so simple if we allow it to be simple. In this month of September, God is setting a student on a new path. And that new path is a path to significance. And I'm believing God that as the saints are marching in, that you will be part of the number. Because I'm believing God that there is a word that you will hear this month. That that word will stay with you until you follow the directions, you will not be able to rest. I'm believing God for you that in this month of September, that God will give you greater responsibility to carry. I'm believing God that the things that are worrisome for you now, in terms of provision, in terms of care, that the Lord himself will take care of it. I am believing God that those your children that you are worried about, God himself will look after them. I am believing God, brethren, that by the end of this month, your business will not be the same. I am believing God that by the end of this month, where you are even now financially is not where you will be at that time. I am believing God that by the end of this month, God will not be a mystery to you. Let us stand on our feet. But then we want to lift up our voice, we want to talk to him. Whenever the word of God goes like that, there is something for you to do, there is something for me to do. So you want to talk to God very quickly. What do you need to do? What character flaw do you need to repair? What do you need to change? Who can you remember that God was compelling you to help, but you did not? Sometimes, even if you are, even if you are, you are, whatever you are doing, sometimes God wants you to do something for somebody just free of charge. Maybe some of you are recollecting opportunities that have been lost. You want to talk to God for mercy, you want to ask him for mercy. As you ask him for mercy, you want to pray for another opportunity. Remember, I said one of the benefits is that you have an opportunity to grow. Say, God, in this month of September, give me opportunities to grow.
opportunity to grow into you opportunity to grow with you oh opportunity to grow in my Christian work give me the opportunities oh Lord lift up your voice and ask God that God Almighty will position you in such a way that you will not miss another opportunity in your lifetime. Lift up your voice as you talk to him very in a few minutes and say, Lord, every provision that I'm looking for that is embedded in the growth that I'm walking into Father, make me at peace with 